Hello everyone, Crystal Vision here, welcome to another part of Spyro 3, Year of the Dragon. Hey look, it's a uh, Metropolis background there, you see that? That's the background of Metropolis. Oh fuck, he dropped. Jesus, that's a fantastic first part. Um, that's bloody fantastic. Alright. Yes, so it is. <laughs> Alright, time to fix the audio for one second. We are off to a rocking start. This yep. is... This is this... I, I want to say something first. Oh, shit. Well, now, actually, she wants to say something. So, let's... <laughs> Alright, here we go. Hey, you finally made it, Spyro. Hunter was a little worried about you when you went off to fight the sorceress, but I always knew you'd beat her. This place is where the sorceress kept all her treasure. But after she was defeated, a bunch of thieves came and stole it. If you can catch the thieves, you're more than welcome to keep the treasure. Thank you, Bianca. Um, so yeah, I want to say something quickly about this level. I have not played this level um, in about 10 years. I mean that. It's been about 10 years since I've played this. Uh, joining me today is the AFH 013. Uh, as well, so welcome yes. back. My uh, volume may be lowered because of. No, I fixed it before you joined. That's all good. All good. All right. Okay. Good. Because but, you know I dropped there for a moment, so I was worried. Okay. Yeah. No. Uh, that's 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 fine. Uh, yeah. The only issue is that I can no longer see your screen. Oh really? I uh, I will I'll fix that right now. Give me one second. Okay. We got a pair of earphones. Like phones, 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 phones. I come from the land down under. Da, 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 da. Boom. All right. Here we are. I was going to say alright so, but I realise I say that too often. But So yeah, it's been about 10 years since I've played this, and I must say, at first impressions, I actually do like this level. Like, I'm looking at it, I, I do like the Super Bonus Round, but as Al and I discussed before this part began, I feel like there's a, a little bit, a little, not a lot, but a little bit to be desired um, in this particular level. Uh, what do you think? Well, like... <laughs> I, I like it as well, but you can tell that there could have been a lot more to it. That's that's the main issue. Like, yeah. no, sorry, I thought you were lagging out for a bit. That's all good. No, oh no, no, it's all good. No, I'm still here. Yeah, well, like it's just ah, oh, like for example, your man, what was his name again? So chicken. Uh, yeah, so chicken, <laughs> Mr. The yeah, Mr. Yeah. Theo. He pointed there this out go. in the comment section. Uh, he basically said that in the Atlas, it's called the Super Bonus Worlds, uh, and then this level here is called the Super Bonus World. So, uh, usually in the Spyro series, we categorize a world as a home world, basically, and we categorize a realm as the, as the individual level that is within the world. So, calling it the Super Bonus Worlds definitely suggests that it's actually a... a um, What's the word? Like, it's actually a world instead of a level. So, very interesting. Uh, what what they could have done is they could have had portals in this level. Maybe this could have been a portal, you know? Or maybe um, the thing over there could have been a portal. I mean, anything could have theoretically been a portal. Oh, wow, I never even thought of that. Okay, that's that's pretty damn good. I mean, what's, yeah, what's that's stopping so it? true. You know, what's yeah, stopping Yeah, that, that's it? right. Yeah, this, this could have, like, there, that was my theory, you know, this would be actually a home world and like that that could have been like that pathway there that might have been i don't know like the the whatever the rocket or whatever you used to get over here you know like that's just, true well, i'm gonna talk to there. her but I'm, you there. can still talk i'm just want to just have oh, a look what she way. says okay um, hunter right. is around here he's been tinkering with his new toys all day and he wants to show it off oh yeah that's revealing the thing you're going to see in a minute uh, later on but no yeah yeah you're right um like yeah i know <laughs> <laughs> oh god. <laughs> devious, devious stuff right there. Jesus. I'm sure she knows all about his toys, so. <laughs> <laughs> Sex, there we go. That's just, just, just to clarify. Um, Nintendo Freak, calm down. Okay, <laughs> calm down. <laughs> <laughs> they, they, all, they all know who they are, but um, so do you notice how it shares basically the same kind of uh, architecture as as the um, super and uh, not the super bonus, sorry, as the wind? No, what's not winter tundra? Uh, geez, I'm missing out. Um, what's it called again? The fucking world. What's it called? Um, uh, midnight Mountain. Midnight That's it. Midnight Mountain. Yeah, there we go. There we go. 
Right, yeah, it does actually. They just so yeah. Well, you know, I don't blame him for in a way, and it's it makes sense because the super bonus world is in Midnight Mountain, and it's supposed to. Yes, well, te yeah, yes, technically. But see, yeah. it, it's it's treated as an even smaller portal as the Dragon Shores one was. You know how the yeah. Dragon Shores one's like this huge one. And it represents the fact that you actually are exiting Avalar. This, That's right. yeah, it does just seem like yeah, like a normal level, I guess. I'm actually confused as to where you got to go. You got you got to go into the first door, don't you? When you get a certain yeah, amount of gems. Yeah, that's 16, the 16,000 one, isn't it? Yeah, that's it, it the 16,000. Now, where is that? I gotta, I'm not properly yeah. looking. Give me one sec. Uh, oh, what I quite like is the, I, I don't know if it's intentional, but the maybe unintentional callback to uh, Winter um, winter Tundra, because, you know, the fact that it's like the last, I like it how the last level was winter, because I always thought that Spyro did an excellent job with the whole um, winter, kind of like the icy levels. I've always liked yeah, the icy really levels. Does. Likewise. Each, each ice level felt unique. Now, here's, uh, here's yeah. Hunter. This is very nice, but let's see what he has to say. Hi, Spyro. Did you see Bianca? She was really worried about you when you went off to fight the sorceress. It was pretty funny. She tries to play it cool, but she was scared stiff until you came back safe. <laughs> Classic. Okay. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah. Right. I just That's nice. Up that is very submarine. nice. It is. Why don't you try taking it for it a is. spin? I think he was scared it stiff, is. not not she. It, it, it's very nice of her to to be concerned for Spyro. Like yeah. Hunter's just a dick. Yeah. So. He, yeah, he is. He is. Uh, <laughs> fuck Hunter, 2014. No, no, no. That yeah, that would be something that Ratchet Five would say. Yeah, yeah. No, 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 that's something Owen would say. Mm, fuck Spyro Three. Skylanders, or whatever. Yeah, so. exactly, exactly. Heavy on, but yeah. still. Yeah. Just, no. that, that's very much, uh, that's very much true. Like, but actually, yeah. um, so with this bit, uh, that was a very, very quick and unintentional segue, by the way. It wasn't like I was trying <laughs> to dismiss what you were saying, but this is, but I've completely forgotten about this. Like, I mean it, like, I've completely forgotten. I did not know this existed. I've, really? I, it's been, well, it's been 10 years. Do you know what I mean? Like, I, right. I just haven't. Well, do you want me to tell you what else is, is to come up, or do you want it to be a surprise? Um, I do know what is next. I know we've got the the special Skateboard. race, which is quite difficult, uh, according yeah, to some. We've got right. the we've got the super we've got the special power up at the very end, with where you uh, have like the super flame and flying at the same time. Ah, uh, yeah, you're right. And is that it? <sighs> no, there's that might actually be it. Damn, yeah, it's that very, sucks. Yeah, it really does suck. Like, oh man, like. It, I, I'm still trying to, you know, I'm just getting over the fact, like, I didn't even, like, when your man mentioned his super bonus worlds and I had my theory about it being, like, a, a proper world in and of itself, I didn't even remember the fact that the doors, which have, you know, 16,000, 70,000, 80,000 gems, I didn't even remember that those could have been portals. And, and how convenient like, is it? Is it that there's four doors? Four! It's, man, that's just, yeah, that, that is crazy. Like, I mean, um, I think that I think the point is, is that we know due to all of the interview, like the interviews, the questions and stuff, the Oliver Wade stuff, that they, there's no conceivable, conceivable time frame where they could have done another world. We, we I think we oh, know that, oh, but oh, it's oh. more like maybe that's what they did have in mind at first. Yeah. I think yeah, it's safe yeah. to assume, or even if they didn't have a whole other world, maybe at least the level would be bigger because. Um, it just it just seems like yeah it seems like they they could make these whole things into levels. Do you know what I mean? Like they this could be part of some kind of underwater level. You know I wouldn't be surprised if this was like an underwater level. You could have the race as part of like some other kind of I don't know because it's got it's got like a dark theme again. You know like the dark midnight mountain theme. You know like the yeah background. that's right. You know and yeah. then you've got the third and final bit. So maybe there could have only been two new levels. You know what I mean? Just keep keep the main structure of it. But yeah that's right. Um, there's quite a nice, like, it's a very, like, um, this is, this is different, it's different to the, uh, the Lost Fleet one, it's a lot more of, like, it's got this really cool colour, depending on the area you go to, like, in here it's got this really blue-green kind of text, like, colour, like, uh, overtone yeah. or whatever, and then you go into that other area and it goes all purple, that's just the kind of, that's like this, it's a very masturbatory comment, but it's like the, co like, can you see that? Can you see that, how it, like, changes subtly, yeah, like, uh, it's really I love the colours, yeah, the... The colors. The colors. I like colors. I like I colors. I like color. <laughs> Here we go. Here's the Mr. greeny. Davis. I like color. <laughs> well, that's right. You know, people people do like colors. Actually, there's a 
Oh, there's actually I didn't notice that. There's actually a blur. Um, have a look at this. Ready? Well, they put something out. Oh no, like no, no, not like not like a not like a Chris Benoit blurring type thing. Like I mean, like <laughs> um, here we go. Uh, here we go. If you look in here, it, you probably won't be able to see it. But see, like it blurs. It's a green blur when you go in here. It's like they don't. It's like trying to I don't know process the graphic. I don't know. But a lot of the time they implement blur to uh, make up for the fact that they haven't processed the area that you've travelled to yet, draw distance wise. Um, I'm just thinking of the band Blur now. Oh like, yeah, 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 yeah. It's just pictured there in that little tunnel thing. But to be honest, this is just—it's Lost Fleet, just with wintry shit. Even, like, even, even the Lost Fleet music. Yeah, that's the thing. It re recycles the, like the, well, original the original. Lost well, I, I'm pretty sure, judging with that, all those that, like guitar that, lick yeah. type things. That it's, track was meant for Lost Fleet. Yeah, I, no. Well, it's. I think so. It has merit for both because. For example, the the doo 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 essa that thing that's kind of like this classic sound. But then the guitar like the ling ling ling, you know whatever it is like that that kind of like classic spiral melody does feel like a final level. I don't know why it feels like a bonus level. Yet it also feels like a Lost Fleet. I think it, it it I just think it fits Lost Fleet really well. Like it just it's creepy and Lost Fleet is creepy. I just I think it was probably just Lost Fleet. Then they were just like. But, but I can see what you mean though, which is maybe that's what they thought when they were listening. Maybe they had to nominate a track to put in this uh, place and they just thought, you know what, Lost Fleet, yeah, like that yeah, music fit. Um, yeah, I mean, I, I, yeah, as I said, like, I could, I could see it in both. I think there's, I think, I think yeah, yeah, it definitely yeah. does sound like, it does have that creepy vibe, um, yeah. as you said. Like, but, but at the same time, it does have the classic, yeah, Spyro guitar. Um, it's really quite good, really good melody actually. Yeah, yeah. Now. It is, yeah, it's good. Better than that fucking Sheeta oh, Sob remix. that's just horse shit. I just want to, I think, I must have already ranted, ranted about it in the two parts I was in, but that shit is just terrible. Yeah, oh. that is bad. That was just bad. It's, how could, how could Copeland, like, you know, he must have just been crying whilst he was making that, you know. <laughs> just, just weeping to himself. Yeah, yeah, no, nah, I can't, I... I'd have to agree with that. That's that's very yeah, true. It's so bad. Like it just she. It's just with the, oh, it's so bad. Like I just no. Oh, it it it's, it is bad. But yeah, um, it looks like there must be. Yeah, there's twenty thousand. That's sorcerers. Nineteen thousand, eighteen thousand, seventeen thousand. Right. There must be one more challenge thing that we're forgetting. Yeah. Don't know Isn't what it is. It, I mean, maybe there. Is, um, maybe it's the. Oh, maybe it's the gate. I don't know. Either way. Oh, yeah. so, it see, look just at, opens the gate. Yeah. See. But, yeah. See. Look. Look at this. Right. Look at the. Yeah. That, that. That's the classic uh, Spyro the Dragon game over screen background there, uh, as you can see, um, yeah. which I, I think is a nice callback. But yeah. See, this level here, even it is a, it is like like a super bonus world type thing. But oh, that background there, that is that is completely new. I'm pretty sure that's completely new. The red overtone over that. I'm pretty sure we haven't seen that before. That is completely new. I'm pretty yeah. sure, unless that actually you can see the interlap, right? Uh, oh, interlap, fuck, overlap. Um, <laughs> see here, here's the original. Oh fuck, no, 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 fuck off, no, no, no. Oh Jesus, okay, not yet. Piss off, sorry. All right. um, you can see this is the original background, right? And then it transitions to a new background. There, um, that one there is is unseen. And then it yeah, goes back to normal. A so. lovely roof essence sky mixed with blue or whatever. So yeah, I, I want the yeah roof essence is a very fancy way of saying something tinged with red. So oh okay, yeah. Yeah. I, I like that word. Roof yeah, essence. I like it as well. That's why I remember the roof essence. So, now yeah. I'm going to just quickly do this just to just to very prevent good, yeah. um, just to get some of it, and then I'll do the race in the next part. Because I'm gonna uh, cut them into three because I uh, uh, I won't get all the gems. I'll just get I'll just go one path, right? Just like just as as much as I can get in one go. So it, it is still. interesting how you can actually um, what's the word actually like walk the track. That's yeah, I know. I mean, it's be it's it's much better to do it before you do the actual race. Which of course, if you were doing this for the first time, you probably wouldn't know to do it like that. But yeah, yeah, because getting it getting the gems during the uh, that's just uh, it, it's it is it's pretty, it is pretty difficult. Interesting. 
Yeah, exactly. And, and I um, just I have to point out, I love how they just have these silly snowflakes falling from the sky. It's like, oh, look, it's snowing, guys. Like, it's snowing. Yeah, exactly. No, I, I do like that. Even though if you look in the yeah. sky, it doesn't look like there's any evidence of intelligent life. No. Uh, of, uh, of snow at all. The, the, the climate does really not suggest snow, but... Um, then again, I'm not an expert in snow, having never seen it in my life. So yeah, that's, I cannot believe that. Yeah, yeah this guy's never because in fucking it's... Australia, only only in certain rare areas does it snow, and exactly. I didn't know this. I couldn't believe it. You've never seen snow. That's mad. Yeah. If you well, Crystal Fisher is coming to Dublin, and you're coming that in right. January-ish time, so it could be. It could still. Like it doesn't snow that often in, in Ireland, but it does from time to time. What about um, what about England in that around that time? Oh, it snows more. It snows more in England. So I, th yeah. I think there's I think there's a pretty large chance that at some point during the trip I will see snow. Yeah, so, yeah, I think there is. Oh, especially if you go to Holland, because oh, like cool. where John, like well, you're going to Johnny's first, and I'm yeah, pretty Johnny sure that in yeah. his yeah in his village. In and around there, it does snow, so especially around that time, so it will be winter for us. So yeah, there you have it. <laughs> there we go. Well, yeah, snowing. Uh, yeah, I like I, I like snow, I've, but I've never experienced it. So actually, <laughs> maybe I'll hate snow. That you know, I yeah, I, you could. I could just I use that word abhor snow. Ab I love, ab ab I love abhor. That's, abhor. That's it's strong. a great one. It's a great one. It, it, it's, it's a good one, but it's very strong. Oh yeah, so, that's yeah. what I'm saying. Like, yeah, but don't, don't, don't deny. You know, maybe, maybe I will. You know, maybe yeah. I will. Now I'm just gonna exit here, so and then I can enter. So hopefully I can re-trigger the cutscene, or not the oh, cutscene, right. but the dialogue. So right, right, right. with that, we'll end the part here because I think it's a good, good way to end it. Uh, leave you guys waiting for the, with the race, and then the, uh, the other challenges, and then we'll split it. The third one will be the final. Uh, the final boss. So thank you for watching. Make sure you check out the AFH013's channel, if only to check out the really, really good Spyro 2 Let's Play, featuring someone that I consider a pretty damn good commentator, I must say. I won't, I won't name names, but he's not bad. Well, he's thank bad. you. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs>